Hi, welcome back to a new video. In this one, we are looking at a stock which is actually quite different to what we usually look at. Tonight, we are looking at Tesla stock because Tesla is up right now and a lot of the stocks which we usually look at, which are relatively cheap stocks, are quite um, well, quite significantly down. So the question is, should you buy a company like Tesla instead of buying some of the usual companies that we look at? And obviously, I'm not a financial advisor, so please do come to your own conclusions. But in this one, I'm giving you my opinions. If you might enjoy this video on Tesla, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already because we do look at many different stocks every single day. Now that I've said that though, let's jump in. Right, so Tesla in the past five days, like a lot of stocks, has seen quite a lot of negative action, mainly in the last week where we saw the stock price drop by about 16%. And of course, today we are recovering ever so slightly, and the same can kind of be said for late session yesterday, where the stock was climbing. If you'd have bought this one at the lows only a few days ago, you would now be up about 11.5%, which is a decent gain, especially in these times of volatility, where like I said, a lot of stocks are down. In the past month, Tesla is selling off from this high of around about 800 $180 and of course coming down to where we are now uh, bringing us down about 16% in price now Tesla overall we all know what it does it's an electric car company and the stock itself does receive a lot of hype and generally speaking looking at the pattern for Tesla it's not too dissimilar to the pattern of the S&P 500 in general and how that has been moving in the past week or so or even in the past six months we have seen quite a big increase in this one uh, more recently and now it is selling off similar to Tesla stock so is the whole market crashing it is hard to say i personally believe that it's hopefully going to pull back itself uh, into the next few weeks and i don't think that's impossible especially with what we are seeing today with companies like tesla and some of the other stocks on the indexes as well so i'm quite happy with how this one is moving i think going forwards it could be a fantastic buy i definitely think in the future this stock could be worth over a thousand dollars i think that's definitely not too far away and right now with tesla being down both over the past week and the past month i think it's not the worst point that we have seen to get in and it does present a very good buy in opportunity. So we all know this is more of a solid stock. It has actually been given us decent returns in the past six months, being up a significant amount. If we can get a percentage on it, it is up around 72%, and that is even considering the sell-off of the past few days. So realistically, we all know how Tesla is moving. I do think it is a fantastic company overall. I think the stock has a lot more to give. I think it absolutely could hit $2,000 in the next year or so, and there is a lot of potential there, in my opinion. So I think this is really a decent opportunity to buy the dip on Tesla, but I, again, would use a dollar cost averaging strategy if I was going into this one for a bigger position of course buying more shares over a longer period of time instead of buying all shares at once I think that will allow us to get the best price and the most amount of shares at the best price and that is definitely the strategy that, the strategy that I would use but it is definitely a decent portfolio diversifier if you don't already own some Tesla I think it is a fantastic company and I'm happy with how it is moving I definitely would like to see this one go up even further tomorrow hopefully bring us back to this point here around the 770 dollars range. I don't think it is impossible, but I do think it will be a challenge. But overall, it depends on what the whole market does, in my opinion. So obviously, we all know that Tesla's not going to go bankrupt in the next five minutes. The stock price isn't going to go to zero, and there is a lot of potential for it to even go past $1,000 and maybe even more in the future. So I would consider it a fantastic buy, especially at these times of instability. But obviously, I would make, wait until mid-session to see whether this one plummets on open or even increases again on open. So please wait until mid-session, in my opinion, but please tell me what you think you are doing down in the comment section. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye until then.